Baldur's Gate is right over the hills. And so is Cazador. Cazador and his right of profane ascension. An imperious soiree, attended by devils and spawn alike. A grand ceremony to honor one exalted vampiric master. And elevate him to an unfathomable station. To place him in a position of such esteem. The world will yearn to kneel and offer their necks. Can we get to the part where I kill him? Patience is a virtue, Donald. You'll get your chance. Of course I envy him. Why wouldn't I? The problem with what Cazador has done is that he did it to me. If the time comes and I can stay one move ahead of him, I'll take his place before his blood can hit the floor. Jeez, crank up the emo shit by 11, why don't you? <laughs> Doesn't it sound delightful? For the lucky little vampire on the winning side. After 200 years of shit, pure shit, I think I deserve something better. As much as I want to be empathetic, you almost killed me when we first met, prick. We'll be glorious both, you and I. You'll have your day too. Let's find out more about the ritual before we waltz into Cazador's front door. If we track down my old comrades, the other spawn, we may discover more and be finely positioned for yours truly to ascend. I've played Ascension before. He must love the space monkeys. My, my, you sweetheart. Then there isn't a moment to waste. If we don't find my brethren, they'll find us. Likely with bared fangs. We should get to them first. Then we can make their pretty tongues talk. Unless Cazadors change their orders, they'll be in the dens of this town, seeking prey. Joe, that is not what he was talking about. Oh, whatever. Let's move on. The place was empty. Keep those thugs away from my family. Denuvia! Get these spotters out of my house now! Arthur, sweetheart, you paid me and my boys to be caravan guards. Not cattle wranglers. If you want us to get our hands dirty, it'd be our pleasure. But that'll be extra. What in the fuck is going on here? I also already am not a fan of the bitch's tone. This is my home. I may pride myself on my philanthropy, but I draw the line at being a halfway house. I mean, how long did you leave it sitting empty for? This man's indignant demeanor barely masks a seething anxiety. There's more to this situation than he's letting on. Zenobia and I are just navigating a slight contractual disagreement. Not that it's any of your concern. Well, we've already stuck our nose into this situation. Might as well see how this all plays out. Agreement? Why should I negotiate with the vermin who've stolen my house? I've got nothing to say to them. Well, if you're having such an issue with innocent people trying to find housing in a crisis, I can just call up the Flaming Fist to deal with your whining. You want the Flaming Fist poking around my business, my property? Gods, I'm fine, they can stay. Just don't blame me when they turn on you like the mongrels they are. Fucking Fornival from Dragon's Dogma had more dignity. I respect your hustle, sweetheart, but it won't work on me. You've stepped on the guild's toes. And we'd like a little something to make it better. Like what? You're just a fucking beggar. The guild, a loose coalition unifying every criminal outfit in the city under one collective rule, from cut purses to contract killers. Go on, tell me what you want. I'd say you'll live to regret it, but honestly, I'm not so sure you'd live. Does she not see the army you have behind you? Holy fuck, I'm in my 80s, and even I know that's a dumb fucking thing to say. There! Maybe that'll knock some sense into your stupid ass head. That was a mistake on your part, sweetie. A mistake the Guild will hear about. Come on, boys. We've got places to be. Fucking send them all our way. We have the numbers and power to wipe them out. Ha! 
Halt! By orders of Lord Gortash, refugees are no longer allowed in the city. Turn around. Do I look like a fucking refugee to you? Or do you have the means to support yourself? If we have made it this far, I would fucking assume so, lady. My good lady, I am Will Ravenguard. I will not pay to enter my own city. Ravenguard? Ugh, more like the ghastliest tiefling south of Neverwinter. No refugees. It is decreed. Looks like she's really not about to let us in. Show her some coin. Maybe that'll convince her. Right. Article 30.1.5 of the Council's decree on extraordinary wartime measures. I am confiscating that. The city thanks you for your contribution. Your name? Uh, John Smith. Well met, citizen. Your parasite stirs. From the construct, you feel connection, resonance. Are we allowed to go through now? Not just yet. State your business. Are you fu- This is bullshit. First, I had to see Joe at the border with me. Now this! Uh-huh. Eyes open, body still. Eh, fuck it. If we end up fighting to the death, then so be it. Behind the Watcher's gaze, a presence awakens. You are seen. You are known. Whoa. <sighs> My engine, it's almost... I don't know... Buzzing. Like it's paying attention. Your party's prior transgressions are reflected in its stare, as witnessed by the cult's ever-alert, scrying eyes. It has heard the howls of slaughtered goblins. The Watcher speaks directly into your mind with a voice like poisoned honey. You are marked for special treatment. Not simply an enemy of the people, but an enemy of the Absolute. Come quietly. Or die. I didn't come all this way to get fucking arrested by a giant fucking tin can. Now fuck this shit, you can fucking die for all I care. Now then, let's fucking proceed like we were trying to. Hi. It's me, Yenna. You remember me, right? You were really nice to me before, and, um, my mum hasn't come back yet. She might come later. Did I miss a chapter or something? I don't think she's coming. Could we maybe stay here? <laughs> Only a truly callous heart could refuse. Besides, our little abode could use a child's laughter. Yeah, I met this kid when we entered. Skipped past the dialogue because I thought it was boring, and now she's yes! here. We might as well listen Fire to her this time. everything. I can cook really good. Whatever you want. Thank you, thank you. Not often do you get the sense of happiness like that. It's almost as if you adopted her. We're not going that far, Obama. Who the hell turned on the big-ass nightlight? Every night, it's something different, ain't it? Also, appreciate my OC Queen being here. Flackers. You are a Sherlock, and still you speak my name. I've seen the captive Orpheus with my own eyes, spoken to Shestil Kithrak Voss. You lied to us, enslaved us. The betrayer Voss lies! Fuck's sakes, this is just a damn he said she said thing now. I have only a moment, and you, a Sherlock, will listen. We are Githyanki. We move mountains. We snuff out stars. We shake the plane. So that's why my plane has more turbulence than I normally feel. The traitor Voss has lied to you. Fuck you, bitch. The heretic prince would shatter us in an instant. The great dominion shrunk to the head of a pin. Can this be true? Is the Githyanki prince really a threat to his own people? Or simply a challenge to Vlacketh's rule? Yeah, nah, I'm hashtag Team Orpheus. Return to the astral prism. Slay Orpheus the Pretender. Serve me, and I will ascend you. You will 
will be no mere warrior, nor Kithrak. You will be Bart of Lackith, commander of dragons. My only, my chosen. Just say you're a bad liar already. A final chance. Kneel before me. Make your promise. Lazel's thoughts become yours. The sight of Orpheus looms over her mind. Voss's words echo within it. She means to forever turn her back on Vlaketh. I would rather see you quiver at the sight of someone who may or may not skewer me when he is free than to agree to your shit. I gave you my faith and you called me traitor. I gave you my life and you ordered your knights to hunt me. I have witnessed too much, and you have given me too little. Finally, I can see. Orpheus will live, and I will hear his creed. This is my word. Your word is nothing. You are nothing. The Kithraki will bring you. I will tear your flesh from your bones and devour your skull's marrow while you beg for death. I will consume you. I will unmake you. Maybe if she wasn't a fucking hologram made by Microsoft's HoloLens, I'd actually feel threatened. Wait, what's going on here? I don't remember starting anything. This will do. Take off your clothes. What? You heard the lady. Take them off, cowboy. Um, do we have a plan to censor this for YouTube? Fine. Well, don't just stand there. Turn I have a plan, around. and it involves the editor with his skills. I mean, maybe I said something beforehand, and I didn't get the hint till now. I'm stupid, okay? You haven't even attempted to peek. I'm a little offended. I'm nervous, okay? Can you even blame me? You're lucky I didn't have anything more dangerous to throw than undergarments. Why is your hair suddenly black again? And were you trying to fucking kill me? What? Don't just stare. If this isn't death by Snoo Snoo, then I don't know what the fuck you have in mind. Might as well do your part, Don. Even though I look like I'm from a black metal band? Chicks dig that shit now, dog. I can do this, now that I'm here. So at first it was wolves, and now you're afraid of fucking water? Good thing I'm here to fucking rescue your dumbass if you panic too much. I'll go in first to show you it's safe. What? Wait! Come in after me if you have the damn courage, Shadow Coward. Come on, Don, stop being so harsh towards her. She's your girlfriend in this game that you willingly chose, so stop being a prick. Oh, hells, that's cold. Maybe we can do this with Carlac in a future playthrough. I don't know, maybe it'll help her with the engine shit. Come here. <laughs> now I think this is pretty cute. Even if Don looks like a monster. Oh, one day, this will be Thank one you. of you with me. I needed that. I needed to know I can face things without Shah. Is this your fucking thing now, Zarbon? Invading videos outside of a meme? I don't want to go back. Not just yet. <laughs> it's boring when all I'm to do is make a moaning noise and then fuck off to wherever. I want to be included sometimes, you know. <sighs> Just a pebble? No, we're not doing a Zarbin playthrough, guys. That'd be stupid. He'd fuck anything that has a pole. Now don't you dare stop. Yes, I got my dick wet with Shadowheart. Ha! Remember that time where I missed my moment? I redeemed myself, motherfuckers. And you all didn't get to see it because we'd get banned.